Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the knowledge representation using frames, guys. Guys, this concept seems to be really interesting if you are done with DBMS. Basically, this concept also belongs to DBMS. So, in DBMS, whenever you are creating tables or anything, initially you will be drawing ER models and all those things, right? So, it is almost similar to that. So, frames are record-like structures that have slots and slot values for an entity. So, for an entity, we will be having slot and inside that we will be writing the slot values. Okay, so once we are going to the example, you'll be having a clear idea. Don't worry. So a slot in a frame specifies a character of entities which the frame represent. A slot in a frame continues can, contains information as attribute, value pairs, default values. So employee details. The name is Raj Sharma, the guy name. So his he is nothing but the entity. And the professor, Raj Sharma, professor, value manager. Employee ID, value some value address value delhi like this so this is nothing but a slot and this is the slot value guys that this particular slots value is written here that's it so in this way we'll be representing guys so basically we can even represent this in terms of graphical also so about raj sharma or okay let us assume you are having 100 employees okay so this will be your employee or your college name or anything name so in that different different departments so each department is having the particular guys and the, the guys details like that. So the guys here till here you will be having the graph. So you can even represent in the graph format guys. Guys if possible I will be just searching for some frames graphical plus normal representation so that you will be having a clear idea. So similarly if they gave a statement and they asked you to write it in terms of a frame. So you can write it in this way. Tweety is a yellow bird having the wings to fly. So what are the different things guys? Tweety is the bird name that's fine. So it is color is given, its species is given, it says that it is having a wings and it says that it can fly. So Twitty, species, value bird, color, value yellow, activity, value flies, instrument, how it is flying guys with the help of wings. So instrument wings. So in this way you can represent guys. So I hope everyone got a clear idea on this. So in the next lecture, by this we are completing the second unit guys. So in the next lecture we will be going through some important topics of this chapter. Thank you. Thanks for watching.